we have quite a number of weather alerts for the coastal areas of the Eastern Cape and Kwasulu Natal. Heavy rains expected this Monday in those parts of the country. We talk about that shortly. We already have a pretty unsettled weather going on around the Free State, the Eastern Cape, and also eastwards into Kwasulu Natal and much of eastern South Africa. It is a wet and misty start to the day around Hauteng, where we're going to be seeing up to 60% chance of thunderstorms extending into Limpopo down into the Free State. And here in the Eastern Cape and Kwasulu Natal, where you see that darker shade of blue, we are expecting up to an 80% chance of rain and thunderstorms. It is going to be mostly fine for the Northern Cape and the Western areas so of the Western Cape. A bit of fog, however, this morning along the West Coast and the Justin interior. It is going to be rather breezy along the Eastern Cape coastal areas, winds reaching speeds of around 35 kilometers per hour in places light to moderate winds for the interior. Now here's a look at those weather alerts. We have up to level five warning for heavy downpours resulting in localized flooding for the north coast of the Eastern Cape extending into the Deben and uh, uh, Deben area and also over the Richards Bay area up to two percent uh, Two, level two warning for that. Level two warning for flooding as well around the rest of the Eastern Cape coastal areas. Then over the Eastern Escarpment, we have a level two warning for severe thunderstorms, high fire danger alerts for parts of the Northern Cape. Now here's a closer look at what you can expect for your part of the country. Houting, partly cloudy to cloudy with uh, isolated to scattered thunderstorms in most areas. Uh, thermometers still in the lower 20s around Springs, Johannesburg and Bronco Spread. Pretoria should make it to 24 degrees this afternoon. We are also going to see isolated to scattered thunderstorms across much of the Limpopo province. It will be pretty warm for the western areas, cool as we go towards the eastern sections. Polokwane managing a high of just around 22 degrees. In Mpumalanga, we should also see scattered thunderstorms for the eastern areas. Much cooler here with highs in the upper teens and lower 20s for most areas. Warm, however, for Skukuza peaking at 28. Pretty wet in KwaZulu Natal with that warning for heavy downpours in areas between Durban and Port Shepstone. Temperatures in the upper teens and lower 20s for the whole province. It is going to be pretty wet as well for the coastal areas of the Eastern Cape, especially between Port Alfred, East London, extending into the Coffee Bay area. Uh, 22 for the high in Tata, 21 in East London, even cooler as we go towards Gaweka. It is going to be dry for the bulk of the Western Cape. A few showers possible for the Eastern areas, especially for this morning, mostly sunny for Cape Town with a nice 27 for the maximum. It gets hotter as we go towards Clad William, peaking at 31. Sunny skies for much of the Northern Cape, a bit of cloud possible for Kimberley and the high of 29 is forecast for Kimberley. It is going to be stormy for much of the free state with isolated thunderstorms in most areas. The storms could become intense as we go towards the eastern areas and temperatures are going to reach the upper 20s for much of the province. Passing showers for the eastern areas of the northwest, mostly sunny for Mahikeng, warming to 31. Clear blue skies overhead for Tosca with a sizzling 34 for the maximum. We stay with wet weather over the eastern areas as we go through Tuesday, but dry conditions are expected for your Wednesday. That's all from the weather desk.